Good morning, it's Wednesday 7th of August and it is uh, 20 to 10 Anyway, it's a lovely day It's um, it's sunny but it's humid Look at that sky, it's absolutely beautiful I know there's grey bits in it but it's beautiful I'm still in awe if I go flying, you know and I'm above clouds ogling at them Anyway bit worried this morning because I've had to use me I've not made the bed yet but I've had to use my so beautiful this morning I'm hoping it's because it's humid and not that me and Ayla, uh, steroids aren't working anymore but uh, it's the first time I've had to use it since I went on steroids so and I only had to go downstairs and get a parcel from the post which was um, my tape normally when I put my last tapes in or, or I open my last packet of tapes or I put my last dime or labeler in and I order it but over its skin so I've had to wait so now I've had to order tape and dime or labels and then I'm going to use my voucher uh, to get some I put that cloth there because I'm getting like hard skin on my elbow because I've got my elbow on there all the time uh, I need I don't know what I particularly need really but what size shall I get um, I don't know what's their biggest, but I suppose I suppose you use this one quite a lot. Yeah, yeah I think I'll get that one for my clothing. And um, I've got to have a tidy up. Look at look at this. There's this is the reality. This one, two, three cups, packet of biscuits. Uh, five cups to get rid of uh, a list of things that I've not stuck a label on so I can't take it in the loft yet spare bubble because I've, uh, I've filled my bubble wrap thing there and oh I need to bring one of these down um, what else is on here oh just stuff Screwdriver because I was sending a toy and it didn't have an off switch so I thought I'd better take the batteries out and uh, I was going to get cracking this morning but Lex was on her part two of her vlog and my uh, phone had not charged up so I couldn't start my video anyway so I thought oh I'll have a coffee because there aren't enough cups in here so I did that I've watched Lex that was brill uh, she's looking luscious. I was a bit worried when she was having the lips done, but um, to be honest, they, they look they look really good. I've seen people that have it done and they have it a bit over the top. And they look like stick them to a window. So yeah, no, she's done. She's done well with that. Uh, this morning already, I have photographed this one before my phone ran out of battery, and we're needing lights on already because it's quite dark this side. And um, it turned out we've got, oh and it's not um, Black Pearl, it's the uh, ghost ship, uh, Captain Salazar, I think his name is, and she's Silent Mary, I think. And I did find out what it does, if you move that, the front opens up and these things like, uh, and then the sides open but they open a bit too much. But I've looked on YouTube and that seems to be the case. Somebody else's was like that and they'd only just took it out of the packet. Uh, this has got cannons inside here. Uh, and then you've these are the ghost um, sharks. And then there's two other little sets in here. That's the um, Jack Sparrow one. And then this uh, young man whose name escapes me. Uh, yeah, and there's two captains. One's got the clear bit, and uh, one's got his white face with his lovely hair blowing in the wind as it is in the. But looking on the YouTube things made me think, oh, I want to watch that film again. Oh, and I found five projectiles. I didn't think I've got any, but it looks like some of his bitten bottoms off them. But I think they'll still work, but I don't want to actually fire them across. Across, so I'll just try one in a bit. Um, yeah. And that, that weighs a ton. It's a bit, uh, oh, I've got muck in my fingernails. Uh, that's because I've been cleaning, see. 
so that's that one photograph now i want to i've set out what i'm going to do i'm going to do that one in a minute because i've got some people i've set this is three bundles and um vtech and leapfrog um because it's like jamming music and uh, uh, steering wheel and stuff like that uh, and then here i've got three uh, which are more girly or more baby and they are all vtech so i've got one two three that's only four and uh, i think i'll do the rocket that's five and i'm going to fisher price people for the house um yes yeah, so that's only five really oh and then i'm gonna um oh, they need to go upstairs i'll take them in a bit uh, and then I'll, i'm gonna just gonna take these up uh this is what i listed last night and uh we'll go and pick what i need i'll take the ipad up with me it's not much but we'll go and get it right Light's not coming on again. I've got two lights and I either get one of them or none of them. I think I very rarely get both of them. Not working today, I don't know. Anyway, I've taken the stuff out that I've brought upstairs. So I've got these. I'm going to put these away in a sec. Um, but before this goes on here, I'll just pull things out. Do you remember the one I did with the um, Zippy photo? That one's just gone. $24.99 so that's true religion um, men's that one uh, well I'm here clothes khaki trousers that's that Black suede ladies shoes. You see I've not got many shoes left. Black suede. I took an offer on these. They're um, wedge heel peep toe from decoration and the ones. I took an offer I think about six fifty. But about twenty five for the shirt. I took an offer on them for about eight. Uh and what else? Oh, the house. Um, $14.99 for a Fisher Price house. You see what I mean about having space? I've got all this space left here now. What's under there? Nothing. Yeah. So I'm all right doing these, but $14.99 for that much space. It's probably not good for most people. Um, I just love doing them. I just love doing them. That's that. And these. Those in. I'll pull a suitable box out. The others I'll just put in a bag or wrap them. And I think that's going to need to be a crisp box. Sorry, it's a bit dark. Crisp box, let's see. Wide enough. That uh, yes, it is wide enough that way. It's wide enough that way. So that just gets chucked down there. And uh, put these away. If I can do it with one hand. M's. I'd run out of cards. See how much more difficult it is when they're not in a shirt card. New look. Next. Next. Night. So we want new look in there. Oh my god. I can't wait to order some more cards. Mind you, one hand until I buy the Ted. 
I've got Ted and then Wallace. Ted and Winnie, I'm not swimming about as much. Straighten you up when I've got two hands. Right, so that's those um, figures. Should I like figures? Oh, these are all figures at this end. But they're all, they all stay on that shelf, so I don't need a skew number. Uh, I suppose if I'd got a million, I'd have to. Still not sold this. So I'm waiting for Christmas now. Bugger them. I'm not going to keep dropping price. Uh, they take some cleaning, sorting out and packing, so and it's a lovely little set I've put together because you get that and all that lot. So no, it'll wait well Christmas now. Uh, and then lady shoes. I used to put these in alphabetical order on there, but you know what I'm like. But um, there's that few of them; it don't really matter. So that is that. I'm going to go down and pack, and then. Uh, I might have to have another coffee because we haven't had enough this morning. Right, my post's done. I am, uh, I'm going to have that clear up now. I started doing it, I wanted to do a time lapse thing, you know, like Carla did. But when I did it, it was far too fast. It was just ridiculously fast. I don't know what you're supposed to use, but time lapse on my phone wasn't doing it. Uh, so I've actually just done all this bit. Uh, I've cleared all this side, which is, which is good. She's good, I'm quite pleased. So that's that bit done, and now I've got to do all this side. So I'll see if I can uh, prop you up somewhere. Look. Sorry. Have a look, what's that got? A little bit more. the pink bit oh yeah right I'm not doing right up at the top I'm not doing the shelves I'm just doing my workspace yes that's a mess isn't it so start here see I've cleared that space I'm going to fill it already because I've got my duplo bags that I've sorted out into what sets they are and I want to won't get them done One of the things that I think is a complete pain is all these coat hangers. So I've ended up putting them in this tub, but they're a ball ache. I'm sick of seeing them. I'd like to have, um, get these boxes down here a bit and have a rail under there just to put all my things. Because if I hang them up as soon as I come back from shops, there's less likely that they're going to end up like this. Crease to death. But I haven't really got any rails down here to do it. And I don't want to take them in the loft until they're listed. That's fatal for me. So, uh, I've, down in this corner, what you can't see is there's a pile of um, clothes and just carrier bags. Loads of lifetime carrier bags. I need to have a look through this. Got this ages ago for my daughter and I sold all, all the fancy dress that were princesses and stuff. But I think this is the one that's got Halloween and Christmas and stuff in. So we're in August already. So I need to start looking at them I think. So at least doing this I'm building a pile of stuff that I want. <coughs> ah! Oh nearly. <laughs> Right, Whew. I'm building a pile of stuff that um, I can list later. That's that. We 
have things like this look it's all a bit random the vibac tapes come yay so much better than the other stuff so much better So I'm not out of shot too long. I've ended up with a little pile on landing that's got to go in the other room and then I'm going to have to tidy that room. Uh, same again. That's just been put on there. That's set 6634 zoo pieces that I can sell. Do that. I've started this... Um, You know they save £667.95 in uh, 365 days and uh, I've got some crossed off I've got them crossed off so I started going down there I thought oh, I better put some of the £3 odd ones in when I've got it and do that and I've got got this much already I don't know what that is 25 quid or something and uh, I thought it would be nice if there were a meet-up or something, if I'd actually got some spending money. So that's what I'm doing. However, the uh, Rington's man came the other day and I didn't have any money on me, so I had to borrow £5.80 out of that. But I've written it down, so I'll put it back in. Where can I put this? So I don't want this so that everybody can borrow a change out of it when they want I'll uh, put it in here. What's that? Sewing kit. Don't need that very often. These blooming fingernails are rubbish. Well, they're good, but they, I knock them off too easily. I wish I could afford to have them done like my daughter's, those look lovely. Anyway, it's another one gone in. Bin. I've got this camera which I used to use for work when I was taking pictures of houses. It takes lovely pictures. And I think it stopped working at some point. I've even forgotten where it on office to be honest. Where is it? No. No. Yeah. Yeah. Can't remember. How can I not remember that? Anyway, I thought it was supposed to come on with that. Perhaps it needs charging. Yeah, perhaps it needs charging up. Yeah, so I've got to look into that one. I'll put that there to have a play with it. I've got Nick on the um, thing, look, that's what I was watching. Nick doing his picking and packing with his GoPro on his head. I like them. Funny how you do all this picking, uh, packing, sorting, all this lot. I, mean, I like watching other people do it as well. But um, I've been very good and paused him because otherwise this would take me ages. So I thought, right, just so you get on with it, film it. And at least you'll get it finished. Dusty. If you remember, this um, blind is stuck up here for when I want to photograph my small parts for things. And uh, I'll trek myself to this book, Carlton Ware, uh, and it's. Uh, When I got the job lot of jugs from, um, where was it, auction, from an auction, I trekked myself to this Carlton Ware book, so, because I, I actually had one of these little jugs, 
one of them. Um, yeah, that one. That pattern jug. So it's helped me identify it because sometimes when you sat at the computer too long, my neck kills me. So I just thought at least I can go and take that in garden or something if I want to, to peruse it. keep these uh, for packaging I keep these insides from the sellotape and stuff and I keep these ones from the inside of bubble wrap mine are 300's mine because otherwise they won't win the loft and these have come in dead handy I sent a, a turn arm for a, a a deck in one of these or sometimes I've used them to cover masts in ships just to give them a bit of extra stability. These I've put down as fillers at the end of boxes to um, keep things away from the edge um, or you can stick them together, uh, stick them all together on the board and make a, um, a thing to put all your tranquilments in, get all glue gun out Stick them all on a board. You put your screwdrivers and all sorts in there. Blue Peter. <laughs> am I crackers? I think I am. I think I'm a bit crackers. So I've ended up getting a mark on this, but it don't matter because I only photograph up there anyway. I don't photograph down there. But uh, that's because I'm just a trollop. And I don't tidy up as a girl. Camera leads, stick all there. Carrier bags, you end up with millions of carrier bags. Um, I've got this I need to look into as well. I bought this for my husband when he went to Japan with my son. And um, it's a Handycam, Sony Handycam. And he used it once. Um, and I think he only used it so that he could say he'd used it. And um, yeah, so it's had one use. And I think the problem is because I bought it without consulting him, it wasn't HD. So he used his phone all the time, which took superb photos. Um, yeah, so I've got that to sell. So I've got to have a look and see if I can find instructions though. I'll be gutted if I can't. Uh, failing that, I'm going to have to go online and try and print some off, aren't I? But that's another one, but I'm not keen on faffing with things like that. See, I'd sooner clean a castle than this. And this and that camera and stuff will get me more money. But might get him to have a play with it later. Let's put that. So that side I emptied is now all full again. And, but this one's empty. So. But at least the rubbish is gone, hasn't it? At least I got rid of the rubbish. Not sure which one that's out of, so I'll put that there. You know, when I started doing it, when I do anything, I have to just go mad and get stuff. And I started um, going through some of my jewellery and checking it, and I, I ended up getting myself a diamond selector. And I've only ever used it a couple of times. So that can go in with my tools. Ah, now that is handy. A pack of these, I can play with these when I have kids over. Do you know when we were at school? I remember the smell of school. I remember the smell of infant school. Went into Mrs Johnson's class and I mean, oh I can smell that now. Oh yeah. Smell of poster paint and Crayola. Huge tubs of Crayola crayons in the middle of the tables and it's four, uh, 50, 55 years ago. But the colour that, that came out after a little while, we'd got the basic colours. And then Crayola invented these. And it was lime green and a fluorescent orange. And uh, we were dead excited. And nearly all us um, 
one of us used to draw a pattern like that and then we take it in turns at colouring a little piece until we got it like a mosaic but the smell oh it takes me straight back lovely it's the only school I ever liked that primary school Well, I've bought these random things last Christmas in the sale down at the charity shop and they're still there and it's one of those things that if I do put them away I'll forget I've even got them so I'll put them on there excuse me a minute I've got uh, like a CD rack at the back there and it's half empty so that'll do Bits of foam and all sorts. I'll stick that in my little packaging drawer. And I bought this basket at a charity shop a long, long time ago. Where's she come from? Oh. She'll have to just go in my figures. That's Belle. Um, what's this? What's this off? Ah. Oh. Now. Can't remember. I think this is off a scarf thing that goes um, goes with the top I've got, so I'll put that in there. It's like a logan looky thing. Doll's dress. Um, I bought this one to car boot, and it's worth diddly squat. It's one of them things that you put on a table to hook your bag on I don't get it I don't get that because what I'd end up doing is leaving that on the table what I do do is put it over my knee and then cross my legs so nobody can get it anyway that's that I don't know why it's rubbish with that two piece um, and this basket I'm going to have a go at cleaning this up later really nice it's got a plywood or hard plywood i think it's called uh, bottom but it's been around somewhere where they've splattered it with something this is what happens you see i'm doing one job and i've started doing another I don't want to get it absolutely wet through, but I've got to get something on it. Oh, yeah. I think that'll come up, look. See the bit I've done? Yeah, that'll be quite therapeutic later. So. When I had the sugar shop, I used to have to clean every every night, clean down and um, disinfect. And then leave it overnight and then when you went back in the morning I'd have to clean down again because obviously dust could have settled in the night. Um, and I don't know if that's why I don't do it because it was just like a oh, ball ache. I mean you even have to swift at ceilings and what. Um, but I really should do it more than I do. I shouldn't wait until it's at the point where I just can't function anymore. You know when it starts to grate on your nerves. And at the back of there is a load of paperwork that uh, I've got a barcode scanner as well because I, I wanted to do books and stuff on Amazon at one bit and then that fell by the wayside but it comes in handy every now and again if I end up buying a load of CDs but that's very rare and uh, that's not even my go. Yeah. 
and then I just put that right on there so that's all ready to get that done well done should I turn that around What I'm going to do is the stuff I'm going to use over there, sort of the wrapping, I'll use that space to, to do those. Here's the rest of the stuff we've got to take away menu. So that I'm going to do later. Put that there. If it's out of the way a little bit, it might feel better. That. That. I'll take that in there because I'm going to clean it. Right. No, I'll take that with you. Right then. So, this is what we're left with. So we've got clean worktop there and can't avoid wires and stuff like that and um, all clean there and the duplo there ready to photograph. Uh, the coat hangers at least are up there and not on the floor. So now because I'd be out of shot I'm going to do the all the floor and actually bring the hoover up and then what's been shoved out of the way is um, to go upstairs, to go downstairs, to go in the wardrobe, to go in the back room, to go in the back room for cleaning. That's just my iPad. That's some posts that I've packaged up that didn't go in today's post, but that'll go tomorrow, but I've already done it. Uh, cups can go down in the dishwasher. Bag can get folded up. This floor's not too bad. Uh, hubby bought some boxes on it and go in the loft um, and then I'm going to get back to this because like I showed you I think I showed you I'd already photographed that this morning so first things first is move the stuff off the landing uh, move this stuff off here bring up the hoover hoover up have a coffee and then get that bagged up um, and that can go in the loft as well so yeah let's see how long this is just got sidetracked again and my battery's going so i'm in the garden but i can't stay long uh, just showing you this do you remember i said i was going to try this in hydrogen peroxide that's the back of it and that's the sides and the front so it looks absolutely minging doesn't it so i'm going to I think if it was smoke it would be all over it so I think it's sunlight so I'm going to try it in this I've got my hydrogen peroxide it's a liquid one and it's it's about four percent so I'm just going to drop it in there and it needs the sunlight so I'll leave it there in the sun a bit overcast today um, but hopefully within a few days that should have cleaned up let's just get the front of it that's it that's what we want so we'll come back in a few days and see if it's worked on the uh, early learning centre. I've got to say that feels brilliant. Oh, it feels so much better. I'm going to really get on with it now. Look, I did Hoover. And um, I can really get cracking. So I bagged that. I put a label on that. Uh, we're just going to take those in the loft so that's bagged up that's all right I've, rem I've remembered to look for these so i may as well get them photographed i think i'll put that near the um little camera thing for to set my camera up on the tripod and i tidied this side off and i'm going to clean that and um right distracts you when you're doing this vlogging lot really so i don't think i'm going to vlog anymore today so i will see you tomorrow Good morning, it is um, Thursday, it's 
Thursday and I had a lie-in and I had a lie-in until 10 to 10 and uh, when husband goes to work and leaves me I will say Phil will you just open me a blind otherwise I'd never get up so he opens a blind and I have a bit of light coming in and um, sometimes with my fibromyalgia I just have to have a day or so where I get up um, I let my body wake me up rather than alarm and then I feel much better and I do feel better today so I'm airing the bed I'm not making bed yet mother always said you should air your bed now whether that was an excuse for her not to have to make the bed so early I don't know but I do it every uh, couple of days souls right I've made a list because um, my iPad's uh, on charge so so one of these which is a PSP Sonic Rivals I've got this for next to nothing I can't remember what don't know where it is but I've sold one uh, 5 .99. and then I've got my list and um, can you see on there you know I said oh, I've not sold my hotel yet I'm going to wait until Christmas so that I'm not just going to keep dropping the price well well it's sold so that's good um, it's all right please sorry that's very noisy um i'm really pleased i got up to a couple of sales this morning and uh, that's been a rare occurrence i've been sales in the morning and uh, a message about the hotel and immediately you think oh this is a mistake by not changing her mind but now she's uh, away until uh well she wants to post it on the 17th preferably so um i'll send her a message back whether this is the right way or not but i usually send her a message back and it's worked out before that i say yes i'm more than happy to do that but i will have to mark it as dispatched uh, and if you'll promise to leave the uh, good feedback i'll definitely send it on the 17th so if she says yes that's what i'll do good because i didn't fancy packaging it today to be honest so that's that so sonic i've got i've got to get uh a bag of connects and a Playmo police dinghy. Um, oh, I'm knocking something off. Look at this again. Oh, I've got left on there, me Playmo bill. Right, so that's me dinghy. Bag of connects. Connects. Um. Now you'd think it'd be with that, wouldn't you? <sighs> okay, systematic. Ah. Oh. Connect, I get connect with instructions. And, uh, I hope that will film in that bit there. I've got low battery on my phone, as usual. And Oasis skirt, which I think I put away. That two days ago. There we go. Oh, this is there we go. So that's it. And then I've just had a phone call. There were interruption in my video because my uh, daughter in law to be is coming with Benjamin. So we'll have a coffee. Right, so she'll be in about 10 minutes. So I best get off. Right, I've come outside to have a look at this chair. It's been out for a day and it's not that bright. We've had some bright sunshine today, but it's not not particularly bright and the, the brighter it is the better I think um, so I'm going to have a look at it and I've brought this down because this is um, I didn't realise how bad this is as well um, but it has got this mirror on so whether it will affect that or not I don't know it's a test but I'm going to chuck this in as well because that's the colour there and that's the colour there so if we have a look we have a look at this chair now do wear gloves if you're doing this. Right, I think we've had some improvement, but it's not it's not there yet. So you can see the difference still on the arms of it. So I'm going to leave that in for another day. Hopefully we'll get some bright sunshine tomorrow. 
but then I have had this a long time whether it loses its effectiveness uh, I'm not sure but I'm going to drop that back in and I'm going to put this in to see if um, if that improves at all and whether it affects that mirror so leave those in there if you're using hydrogen peroxide you need to put a top on or cling film or something or it will just all evaporate away get it shut it and don't leave it near children absolutely not because they'll all think it's water right we'll come back tomorrow so the only problem with that is that I had photographed this and now I've decided to uh, try and whiten those items so I'll just stick this in a bag for now so I can get on with something else oh good morning I'll try again I was just uh, filming this and my phone I ought to put it on airplane mode I suppose when I'm doing it because phone call comes in and then it cuts it off yeah, it's still wet, not done. I went to bed with it last night and I didn't put my gunk on um, because it takes forever to dry then and I didn't want to wait to go to bed till well it were half twelve anyway when I went and I had a shocking night nightmares all night and you know the ones where you it wakes you up I mean one of them were that bad I, I thought god I'm having a bloody heart attack me in a minute so I tried to calm myself down anyway, one of them where when you go back to sleep it keeps coming back. So I think I eventually dropped off and slept fitfully from about, about four o'clock till about half seven so but it was still weren't very good so I might be having a nap in a bit. Anyway I've only got two things going now and uh, shall I lift that up a bit so it make it easier? No it won't do it. Um, Saying. oh yes I've only got two things going out so I didn't go in the loft uh, with you didn't take you up there because I thought it's a dark dismal day it's raining outside it's going to be horrible in the loft if the light don't come on anyway it did come on so I could have took you up but as I said there's only two because I had a cracking day yesterday I had about 250 yesterday but 180 odd of that 189 was the hotel so if it wasn't for the hotel it would have just been a standard day um so there's these two that can go and like, uh, like i said i think the hotel's not going out yet so i've got little tykes robot which is uh it's only gone for 8.99 uh, and it's a lovely little thing i think they'll be happy with it we actually bought it for benjamin um but i don't think he got on very well with loud sounds and it is quite loud so i'm just going to test it because i test it when it's listed um but i'm just going to test it again before it actually goes out so let's see. I come back. Come back. Right. And he is remote control. So I turn this on. So forward. Oh. Whoa. Turn. Oh, so it goes reverse turn or forward. <laughs> right, what's this doing? Hello. I think we can safely say that's working. <laughs> Lovely. Right. That's that. And the only other thing is a dress, which it's an ASOS dress, and I were asking quite a bit more for it originally, but uh, uh, I kept dropping it anyway. I've took an offer of ten pound on it, so um, that's all right. It were in one of my job lots, I think. This or it were a pound rail, but it's a really nice dress. So I'm just going to pack that. Somebody asked me the other day for which. Uh, video had got the packing clothes on and um, I'm a bugger really aren't I because I don't put in the description what I'm actually doing so then trying to find something later is rubbish so I thought I'll have a go to the end of this for you um, 
with my um, card. I don't use these for everything. If they, um, if it's just like a cheap jumper or something, I won't bother. But I think they only work out about ten, fifteen p, which there's always a cost of business, isn't there? And uh, I like things to arrive as I'd like to receive them, so that's that. So anyway, these are my last two. I've got reorder some more, and uh, some of them I leave that, and um, also. They said, do I leave that bit on at the top now? If it's a shirt, I'll leave it on. If it's not, I'll cut it off. Um, so you could just probably get a normal card if you wanted to do that. But I don't know how much that will cost you. But uh, I can do it with my Stanley knife if I've got a lot to do. So that's that. Yeah. And then some paper. I've already wipe this down this morning because just to make sure it's clean and I'm gonna lay this out oh don't catch on that right, I'm gonna lay this out I'll be back in a second I've been to fetch that roller and uh, I'm going to put some more sticky on it. find this is a lot stickier than buying the things that well that you buy to go on it and I'm not paying that out anyway uh, so I did this when I listed it but because it's been hanging upstairs I'll just give it a quick just a quick little black this is like a dark olive green don't know, no bottle green um, so any little bits in the air are attracting to it as I get it out of the bag so that's that tissue are you low enough yeah. right and I'm gonna get my card the one with the thing on up at the top and I'm gonna to fold it over can you see I'm folding it over that corner like that so it makes that shape and then this is going to fold in here like this I'm doing this more slowly oh, it's actually a minute man because it's got a collar and I've left that on so that's going to go inside the collar right then I'm going to fold that in I'm just going to use this bit of card just for the folding so find the bottom of the other one and I'm allowing half an inch for the fabric to fold up and that's going to go up there and like that and then like This one is the uh, 
this bag is the 30 30 by 40 with plus the margin right centimeters and i'm just going to put this in here it's got the warning on i'll put a uh, link oh a hair don't understand them a hair I'll put a link underneath for these bags and cards and stuff um, if you want to. Right, I'm just going to turn that over and make sure I ain't got any bits. job done so that's that one and uh, I'll just fetch a box for a robot but you've seen me packing box stuff before so I'll get this transferred onto the computer and I'll have a look at um, how long the video is not up to an hour yet so I'll do a bit more anyway I'm just gonna watch Nick and Andrea's uh, car boot but I'm going to put kettle on and leave the advert running. That might help them a bit with some pennies. Um, so I'm going to make a coffee. And um, tell you what I'm thinking of doing. Everybody's going on about this stream yard, which is um, a new streaming service because I didn't do many um, screen share things or lives, but... Um, I didn't like the changes to the one that YouTube, you see I've not cleaned that yet, uh, the ones that YouTube um, used to be able to do, the classic studio was quite good, but I've not been able to manage it on the beta, so I think I'm going to, uh, is that on yet? I think I'm going to have a go at doing one, but private, and uh, I'm going to open this. I'm going to open this thing. Oh, I've got to pause Nick. Spin, spin. Pause. Pause Nick and Andrea. Don't Andrea look absolutely lovely in a hat? <laughs> they really suit her. I look like a dog's dinner in a hat, me. Anyway, I'm just going to have one of these and a coffee. Cottage bakery. A pound for four. Can't beat it, can you? Um, sometimes I have a trouble eating a lot. I, I get like, I feel sick before I can actually get around to eating anything so something quite bland is really good and at 25p it's not worth putting oven on is it so i mean they don't they don't make you oh and are delicious but they fill a hole yeah so i'm going to do with that and also before i go i'm going to check the um what's it hydrogen peroxide outside if it's not worked now I think I'm going to have to refresh because I have used that tub a bit uh, a few times now or, or I might look up on YouTube whether it loses its effectiveness Got a few cloths to wash down now and um, yeah what else am I going to do today I might try and get out and about actually because um, sun's shining and I've not seen my daughter for a few days so I might text her and see what she's up to I've got some, oh you can't see them, I've got some, uh, no you can't see it, um, I've got some plants coming up, uh, is it amaryllis, something like that, but the rest of it's been squashed in the rain so, yeah, coffee time, see you downstairs with the hydrogen peroxide in a minute. Right, I'm going to go and have a look at them, all the sun's out. Um, oh look, long skirt, it's no funky trousers today, but I like long maxi skirts as well. I have to wear them down here on my hips, um, instead of up there because otherwise they, they won't, I like things that trail on floor, so they add my feet, so I've got to be careful about showing my feet, I don't like that. And I do change my top, you know, I've realised on my videos, nearly every one I've got, 
orange or peach or red tops on. Um, but do you find like me that you you put your because you don't have to go out to work wear different every day because you're seeing different stuff and that. What you wash gets put in top of your drawer and then when you get dressed next morning you just get what's in top of your drawer so I'm just rotating the same tops I must have a look for different stuff but don't panic I know I'm wearing this in the house but if I go in the loft you have to do what you did when we were kids you know what your mother did like this and you hike your skirt up to your uh, into your knickers so you can go paddling. So I've done that, so I'm not going to fall down in love, don't panic. Right, let's go and have a look. Oh, right, I might have to wake it back up again, else it's going to get wet. Now, this has now been out. It's not quite two days because it's still morning. But we'll have a look and see. See whether it's uh, done its job. What am I sitting on here? A dead worm. Not, not sit on that. So, get all the rain off. So, we need bright sunshine. Typically, we've had all that sun. Now, right, so that's turned over. It's not doing it. It's got some off, but. No, and there's a little crack in that I realised. It's been mended at some point, so probably weren't even worth bothering with to be honest. But no, it's not. It's not done it yet anyway. So I think I wasn't sure whether it would different plastics it works on. So it's one of two things. It either don't work on all plastic or it's not working now. And uh, yeah, I'll leave that on this video and I'll do some more faffing with it. And if it comes out, if I manage to get it sorted, then I'll, I'll let you know. Otherwise, I'll just sell that as it is upstairs. Or put them in and so that they're a bit marked. So, oh, that went a bit wiggly then. It's because I've got a big bee flying around my head. Right, see in a bit. Right, I'm in the car. I've decided it's uh, two o'clock. My daughter's been for a cuppa and um, I can't get going again. Don't know why. So I've decided I'm going to go out and uh, mooch. I'm going to mooch around a couple of charity shops and maybe the vintage shops if I can get some more bangles.
tried to film a bit in there uh, I felt a bit conscious having my camera out and then um, the lady came round and she were coming up behind me and I thought oh I don't want you seeing this in this so I turned it off but I only bought one thing which is a bit of a weird thing and uh, it's got no name on it but I just thought it were a bit different so it'll mean I've got to look it up anyway I've spent that much time looking to see if I could try and find something the, it's now half past two so I'm not going to get to the ones furthest away so um, I'll probably just drop down to the vintage shop I think some of them around here shut about three o'clock so if the footage is alright I'll show you well I've been to two and I've only bought one more thing so that's two items from two charity shops it's taken me an hour and it's about 15 minutes to get home well 10 minutes so rain stop playing now look contemplating doing the next one or not well I bought nothing in the um, vintage shop so I went to another one that I really wasn't going to go to uh, and I bought something else so I bought one item from three of the four shops I bought this uh, which if I show you the footage you'll see uh, and it's a Spears Games look at outfits uh, and it's one of those where even if it's no good to sell. I can probably have some fun with Benjamin because there'll be quite a bit over the school holidays. But this place always tapes them up. So I don't know what's in it. And um, there's a date. Oh, well, you can't see it because of the reflection. You can't see it. I'm going to have to look it up. It's a date in Roman numerals, so I'm going to have to work that out. Um, 3450, I think it's 1984. MCML XXX 1V. 1984, I think. Um, but it says tape player required, so we'll see uh, we'll see what it is. I've only just noticed that to be honest. Um, mind you, that's never stopped me. I usually make things up as I go along. Right, so I'll have a look in that. Shall I open it now and see what's in it? Mm. Nice. Mm. Yeah, the two old sides, that would be much better. And it's the sort of place where they don't... Um, I don't think they check stuff in here. So that's we have a board, so that's the start. Um, with chips, honey, Susie, and you place a dog name tag. Oh and Ben's there, so we've got all four we've got four name tags. My sister had a dog called Honey. Uh, Chips. Oh, and the Susie look. Yeah, right, dog. Uh, there, we've got a bit of board. Oh, we've got a doggy ball, but look at things. One, two, three, four, five, six bones. Oh, and hardly anything else. So, there's a tape. And two 
two chips, three, four chips. So what do you do with this? Sixty minute audio tape with instructions and music. Four doggy playing pieces, four personalised name tags, six coloured bones. What did I say there was? Six, yeah. Six coloured bones and a girlfriend. So it's all there. It's just uh we'll see if that cassette works. Yeah, it's not been rewound. Right, we'll have a look. So that's that's probably worth the uh... Oh now it, we're off price. Um, it was half price. Well, hang on. Yeah. Yeah. Let's even look. The sticker on it said one bit. Yeah, seventy-five p cost me. So not a bad thing. Seventy-five p for that. Now this is the weird thing. This. There's no name on it. There's no. Um, Maker's mark or anything like that, and uh, I didn't look it up, I just thought I'm a minute, and it's like I say a very, very random purchase. Uh, young girls very kindly wrapped it up for me. I'll get in it in a minute and right, put it down again. I'll get some carrots. Blimey, she's done a good job. Done a good job here. Right. Okay, right. There. What do you think to that? It's... It's a skeleton skateboarder. Two pound it was. Oh, I think it's amazing. All these bones sticking out of his trousers. Yes, there's all these bits and bobs. There's no um what's that? Oh hang on, what's that say? Two thousand W U I W U I Focus. I think two thousand W U I or W U L, not sure. Um, I like it. I just liked it. You know, sometimes you just go with your gut and you think, oh, look at dust. Get my brushes out. Like that. Two pounds, so we'll see. And this was the the last one in the shop that I hardly ever go in. In fact, I could hardly recognise it because they'd been... It's an RSPCA one. It looks like they're a new manager or something because they've, they've really sort of decked it all out. Got shoe racks and all sorts. Uh, and there was this, this, can you guess? I've never had one before, never had one of these before. Uh, there's no people or anything with it. Right, and it was £3.50, it looked ancient. So, Looks ancient that, doesn't it? Fisher Price House. Little carport. Carry case. It's quite heavy actually. It's all made of this plywood or whatever you call it. Oh boy, plywood. I don't know my woods. So that's that. So don't no, I don't think Jimmy's supposed to have anything on top. The paintwork all looks quite good. But ironically. Not so long back, I actually sold some really old Fisher Price um, figures. I don't think it's loving family because they would be too big. I think they'd be about that tall. So I don't know what that does unless it's supposed to. Oh, doorbell. Ah! Um, come on, open up. Right, I'm trying to open when I've got it out. Come on, where's you? We're just gonna. 
Right, I'll open it. I've got to admit it wasn't difficult. I just made it look difficult. But it's got all its um, stickers on the inside. That looks amazing. That's really old that. Look at the kitchen. Usually they've had quite a bit of water damage and things, you know, like um, tidal marks where damp's got in a bit. And this can sort of split and raise and it hasn't at all. So it's been somewhere dry. Uh, somewhere dry and dusty, like a loft. Yeah, all these stickers, a little bit muck on it, but if I get brushes on rather than water. But what can you expect? Oh, it's got all these stickers. That is fantastic. What's that little? That's a screw. And, um, ah. Oh, that's your bell. That's the bell. Love that. Absolutely. Love that. And unless any of you have got any people that goes with it to sell me, I'll, yeah. I think I'll probably sell that as it is, because waiting for figures to come in for that might be on a wing and a prayer, really. Um, anything missing here? No, it's just an archway, so it's not supposed to be, not supposed to be windows and things, but um, all these stickers are good as well. Anyway, I've spelt, spent a full two minutes showing you that, so... Should we go upstairs and see if I can look it up? Right, we'll do that. I'll make that the last bit on this video. Right, I'm really sorry, but you're going to have squeaky chair now and again. Which one shall I start with? Uh, right, I'll pick this one. So, we've got the... Um, Skeleton thing. Uh, don't forget my magnifying glass. You're probably seeing that and I'm not seeing it. That's right. Yeah. W U I. 2000. So, first thing Google. Uh, w U I. 2000. Skeleton. Skate. Boarding. Resin. Zeppi? Zeppi. Is it? Hang on. 1998 Wizard. W-U-I. Summit Collection. 1998. I don't know what Zeppi is. Uh, okay. Let's look in all. So, everything about skateboard decks. No. WUI. Let's just put figures first. Figurine. Uh, a bit nearer. Summit collection. Nineteen. Oh, that's it. Say. Uh, Myths and legends. Nineteen ninety-eight. Gothic. Somebody's screaming. A W O I stands for. Um. WUI Dragons 
why it's not coming to me what WUI would be. Hang on, what's that? Collectible. That's a skeleton. Collectible Summit Skeleton. Right, let's write these down. WUI 2000 Summit Skeleton. So that one's riding the scooter figurine. So change that to summit. Summit figurine. See that one was 2001. That one. But a lot of these, oh there's another skeleton there look. Um, yeah, still Summit Collection. Oh, look, footballer. Right, so now let's add skeleton to get rid of the others. Right, let's get rid of the others. Just wondered if they had names, you see. Uh, no, another summit collection. Hmm. Furry bones, sharky shark collection miniature. Egyptian, Pinterest, Amazon. Click. You know, it's a good one sometimes is Etsy because um, sometimes people write quite a good description in them. Right, so let's go eBay now then and we'll have a look for W U I Summit. Skeleton, not Skellington, as people call him. Well, they're nice. Quite different. People are putting W U. W-U-I But I think it would pick it up Try sold There's only that one is sold which is the uh, skeleton riding a scooter figurine um, I if they've put any information about the company from United States, um, no, they don't know any, oh hang on, what's that, um, something collection, some, yeah, summit, city of industry, CA, California, summit collection, hmm, like him but the only one there look is um, there's nothing similar um, $19 so I'll read you non 15 pound and wait for it I'm not bothered but somebody might like that um, let's try it without the eye in fact let's do some capitals WU No. Steampunk, they're good. Oh, look at him. Didn't model that on my husband. No, he's um, got more hair. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> I'm only kidding, Phil, if you're watching. Um, some collection 32, 22, 
drum is. 21, 22. 32.96 for the one lounging and sitting. Still only from the United States. Well, I've got global shipping program on, so if anybody wanted it. Um, w, U. Resin. Skeleton. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, no, we're not going any further on these skeletons. Um, so do that and see. See what we've got. We're all right. Yeah, no, so I'm going to have a good look at about £15 on that one. Um, and it's just... Fab. Right, next. Uh, go fetch spears. Right, let's have a look first and see if I'm right with the... Uh... Oh, uh... Um... Caps lock. C L. L X X X one V. Oh, why don't you tell me? M C M L X X X one V. Roman numerals. Yeah, all right, nineteen eighty four. Blue minute. So that's that. Uh, and I'll just go straight to eBay for this one, which is uh, Spears Games Go Fetch, and it's probably the 75 pence I've paid for it. Oh, one sold at £10. Free postage though. Let's see if there's any on at the minute. Go fetch it parts only ten pound. Oh you go. I missed off the eight, didn't I? Go fetch it. Not that I think that'll make much difference. Um No. Right, so let's go for 10. Go for 10 on the game. Don't forget that costs 75p and the other one costs £2. So up to £25 for £2.75 so far. And the £3.50. The £3.50. Um, I'm going to Google first. Uh, I'm just going to have a sip of tea, sorry. So, I mean, when I said loving family earlier, I think loving family might actually be matchbox. Fisher Price Vintage House. Oh, there it is, first one. Uh, on Amazon. Oh, no. oh yeah. Yeah, it's got the uh, door. It's got the door. I've just pulled it down. So that's good. Uh, it's like a roller door. It's brilliant. Um, vintage. Um, it says little people. But they'd be the very old type of little people. Um, Surprise doll's house. Oh look, family Tudor. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I've not got any of those people. 
No, but I did have. I did have. So, we've got a date on it. Uh, oh, somebody's put 69 to 82, so I'm not sure. Let's see if I can narrow that down a bit more than that. 69 to 82. I'll save that image to um, there, just because it's got the people on it. So I'll save that for later. Anything with the date on? Uh, they've put Tudor. They've put Tudor. That is very similar. But not it's not the same colorways no that is it nobody's putting the dates on are they nobody knows for definite so vintage somebody's just put brown house Right, 1999, somebody took that picture in 1999, um, yeah, can't narrow it down anymore at the moment, I love, I love to see one in its original packaging, that's, um, that's really good if you can find one. So, right, I give in. So, unless I can find any figures, it's just the house that we're going to do. Oh, goodbye. A vintage house, and it's a, oh, $26.99 for it with lots of furniture. And 38 Oh, one in a box, look. Box 1980. So they're going to be the people that know better than other people, I think. Oh, copyright 1969. 1980 Fisher Price toys. Made in Belgium. Did you know it were a division of the Quaker Oats Company? Um, Belgium. I might put vintage date unknown. Um, no date on the box though. Snoopy, it says there. I really wish. Oh, it's there. So, yeah. Yeah, complete with the figures anyway. So we've got the door on it and that. And um, I think I'm probably only going to be able to ask about £15. Somebody's got one at 20 Let's have a look at sold. Sold. Only six, so I don't even need to bother to change it. Well, I'll do it just in case you... I do see some people asking in the chats about how to look, so... I'll just click that. Um, highest price, the so 38 is good. Look, if I've got all, what a difference them little tiny bits makes. Um, 20 for that one with bits. 15 for just the house. 952 is the house sort of number, um, which it's got at the side of the door, so that makes sense. Um, Five pound on a bid for that one, or fifteen pound for a buy it now plus postage. So I'll go for a fifteen pound on that one as well. 
So 350 to 15, I won't even make 10 pounds on that, will I? And I've got to clean it up a bit, really. I'm not going to go mad because stickers are all right. But anyway, hope you enjoyed that. And um, I think we've gone over an hour now, so I better leave it there. And it's now four o'clock, so uh, yeah, I might crack on with these and get them listed. So love you loads. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to do all the clicky things. And um, I did realise when I was looking into my stats, because I don't look at them very often, but a lot of the people that are watching aren't actually subscribed. So if you've never subscribed to a channel before, just bear in mind, I used to think I'm not going to subscribe because I'm going to get inundated with lots of emails and all sorts of things are going to happen. It doesn't. You only get to know anything if you press the bell. Um, but if you subscribe, um, that's absolutely fantastic for us. So... Thank you very much for watching and I will see you all soon and I'm going to go off and do the have a go at the live thing. See you later. Bye.